but this has happened also in the old train tunnel. Um, So he's probably capturing sounds from the past. Okay. So we can't he's coming through clear as clear as day. So it's like take two on tube, I think it's take three that. Clock. Clock. Candle. Prisoner. Who's got your prisoner? The book Basil. I've got it in my back, yeah. I've got it in my bag, funny enough. Want to get it out? Yeah. He looks good, doesn't it? That's weird how he had the book, yeah, and he knew that he had the book. Africa. Africa. Who are you? I'm Basil Brush. Who are you? What's your name? Angel. Angel. Disfigured. Who is the traitor? Sentenced. Two. Oh, the light's just gone out. One second. <laughs> Welcome to another video. Oh, we're playing um, lights is here at the minute. So anyway, the lights should stay on now. So for the first time ever, I'm in a vehicle. Funny enough, uh, we're at Bear Cup at the minute, and we're coming to a location that I've always wanted to come back to, which was New Church Twin Tunnel. It's my second time here, so this has been my second visit. The first visit I had was in the summer. I've got a quick video I'm going to show you in a minute. Um, so I found somewhere where I can park at least for now. And then we're going to walk to the tunnels. It's raining tonight. Uh, once I get out of the van, I'll show you around. Uh, so the rain has just been constant throughout the day. And it's really bad when the rain comes because it's hard to get activated. But um, it's a full moon. So I've got the book and we're going to sneak into the tunnel. It's going to be really dark, I think, but the tunnel's got lights in it. So it shouldn't be too bad, you know, like street lights. So the, basically the tunnel is an old train tunnel where um, trains used to go uh, back, back and forth out of. Obviously, you know, it was... It was part of the old rail track uh, that um, that they used to be there, that used to go all the way to Rochdale. Now I've done many videos in the, the Rochdale part, um, obviously um, if you would have followed me for a while you might have seen some of them. However, we're not in Rochdale, like I say, we're in Bear Cup, so I went at this tunnel for a couple of reasons. Uh, because obviously I've been to other tunnels before, is to see if there's any trends with this tunnel to any other tunnel. Um, there's lots of growling and grumping going on in this tunnel. I don't know. I don't know too much into that because I'll have to look more into it by using the box. Um, so I want to know what all this growling's about. Um, now there might have been people. There probably was people that died in this tunnel making it, and I've got no doubt there would have been people jumping in front of trains, or there would have been train accidents at some at some point. But the tube should tell us tonight. I've got the book also, and we'll make our way to the tunnel. Um, we'll, when we'll get cracking. Um, so it is actually a full moon. It's Saturday night. It's about half past half past nine or something. I could have come here later, but I don't think it's going to make any difference. I could have come here at 3 a.m. I don't think it's going to make any difference. Apart from there's going to be no people. But I don't think there's going to be any people anyway, so that's why I've come now. Anyway, instead of me, um, yeah, chatting a lot of um, whatever, um, I'll leave you a video now. Um, so you can see the last time I was here. This is a quick TikTok video, so you know what to expect if you're watching for your first time. So I'll let you with this video now, and then you'll see me find trying to find the tunnel because last time I was on foot I walked it this time in a car so um, a little bit different this time anyway see you soon The devil. And you can uh, give him some credibility if you want. 
your chance now. Keep going. You. Me. What about me? Will it come to this device? Stop it. Knights Templar. Sharon. Keith. That's me. Stop what? That way. Zaki was waiting for us, the full moon in between the trees. So I'll just show you around now. So it just basically looks like a road, yeah? Just one minute, let me get the rest of my stuff. Should we take the drink? I don't think I'll need it. I always have these arguments by myself. You need a drink? <laughs> right. Put the bag on, yeah? That's all good. So I think the, the, the tunnels are around here somewhere on Google. So um, I'm just going to show you around this old. Um, I can hear water flowing funny enough. So it says on my maps, yeah, that, that, that it's here. Look at that spook house and that there. It's got a cross on it. Maybe it was a church. Look at the spooky moon! Right, so, uh, I think the tunnels are just up here, so I'm going to have a look on Google now. And, um, yeah, it's, it's, rather, it's rather quiet. Definitely be a spooky one, this, let me tell you. Right, let me find the tunnels, and we'll get cracking inside the, uh, inside the tunnels. Right, after driving around for a while to try and find where I was, I finally found the last steps that I found, or the last steps that I took to find this place. So it's about here and there's like a secret entrance that I'll show you now. I won't say it's a secret entrance, yeah. It's just up here. But you'd never know it was there, and it's the only way to get to it. I just remembered you can't, you can't really drive to this place. <sighs> so it's obviously an old rail track. It's a pathway now, but... Um, I'm sure the entrance is just up here. So the um, the good news is I'm going in the tunnel because it's raining. And it's down here. So that's part of the old cycle track. And this is part of the old railway line. <sighs> right, so it's down here, if I remember rightly. As it begins to rain. So it's quite, it can be quite hard to find this. I might have to stop filming in a minute because the rain's getting too bad. Yeah, I'm going to have to stop filming and then start again when when the rain stops. Right, the rain stopped. The moon's back out. I'm just showing you I've got two torches. Um, this smaller one was uh, a quid and this is the one that I usually use anyway. The XMTX. It just gives us some extra brightness so you can see. But I, even if it went dark, I could I could just put the SLS cameras on. But um, I, if I remember rightly, it's been about six months since I've been here, and I've only been here once before. So um, hopefully I remember the way. I think this is the way anyway. I'll just show you around. See, obviously you could tell where the, the train used to come through here because the land is higher. So they've had to they've had to dig like the rail track. That will dig the foundations for the rail track, and that's probably something relevant there from the track. The old stone, the old stones, whatever. And that, it looks to be a spring there, but I don't think it's a natural one. Yeah, let's keep moving. I can see some lights ahead here, so I think, yeah, the tunnels are ahead here by the looks of it. So I've never been at night here, and when you go to Wheelerdale, you get the same thing with the um, with the river running across the pathway so the lights in the head are the tunnel or is the tunnel so I'm going to put some night vision on and um, 
check out our night vision, see if anything maps in. Right, the rain's starting again, and I can hear an owl. So if we get, if we get to the tunnel, it won't be so bad. Obviously, they'll protect us from the rain. Some steps there, that's weird. So this is inside, I don't know what's going on with the torch, in fact it's not it's not thinking, it's not being bright enough. So we just walked out the rain. And this is the church, look, it's obviously the other one sealed off, the other tunnel. You can't get into it, they've obviously concreted it off. Because obviously there was one going one way and one the other. So I'm not quite sure which line this was. Anyway, let's hit the tube and see what we can start to pick up. Let's get to stay with the rain for a in fact, let me walk around first. You can hear that owl again. Huh. It's a good job we're not playing around in Arctic, isn't it? Right, here we go. So I'm going to get, try and get some um, readings now. So hopefully you can see that it's on zero. So let's have a little walk around. Now if it goes off, it should beep. Now what I want to show you is this. So if we go to the light, I can measure the VM. So the VM to the top, which you can see. And if we go to that VM light, it should beep at some point. There we've got VMs, which is telling me it's off the light. So it's safe, you know what I mean? It's not beeping, it's on green. I can stand here all day, and it'll be on green. But when it goes to red, like it did at lock 31, um, you've got some kind of problem. Dripping. It's just dripping everywhere. Got a torch on for you. Can you hear me on this frequency? Thank you. Thank you. That's a great, um, great, great reply to get started. That. Can you tell me your name? So what I believe it said level and that was on my frequency that, that having said that it's hard to tell with the water drippage. Do you know the year is 2023? So this has happened also in the olden train tunnel. That, um, That. So it's probably capturing sound from the past. Okay. No can't, these are coming through clear as clear as day. Um. It's a good audio at the minute. You can come and tell me your name please. You tell me you can't. Why can't you? See where the water seeps through. Take two on tube, I think, or take three, whatever. Clock. Clock. Candle. I prisoner. Who's got your prisoner? The book, Basil. No, I've got it in my back, yeah. I've got it in my bag, funny enough. You want to get it out? Yeah. He looks good, doesn't it? That's weird how he had the book, yeah, and he knew that he had the book. That I will again. Hopefully you can hear it. Portrait. Picture. Right, no worries, we'll do that first, yeah. So they want they want the comm first. The last time I filmed, yeah, I made a mess of it by doing this, by keeping my camera on. Sentenced. 
who, who got sentenced. Let's turn that off. Coffin. Coffin. Keep recording. Yeah, I'm doing. Africa. Africa. Who are you? I'm Basil Brush. Who are you? What's your name? Angel. Angel. Disfigured. Who is it, Teresa? Sentenced. So I drew your picture for you. Which is what you requested. Now you can tell me about the sentencing you're talking about. Coffin. Coffin. Yes, Basil. Yes. Amazing. Thank you. Love your kindness. Shortage. Thank you. Let's get some fox, because I don't want to hear your voice. We went in the neck upon that for a couple of minutes. And, um... I'm just going to normal camera on it. We can find it. There. That's it, the normal camera. Alright, you ready? We can start. Why you've been sentenced? What have you done? Do you know the years? Twenty twenty three. Is that what? Sound like what? That. Them, them noises are getting louder. Like the water dripping. Could be raining heavier for that or. Right, so there's a lot of water. I can hear it splashing. So let's go down here and check it out. That needs to stay on zero so I have no poltergeist or nothing, nothing ghostly. But we've already had some good replies. What's it slapping off that? Oh, there it is, look. I can see it, the golden wall up here. Call the gusher. Hopefully, you don't need the toilet because that'll make it worse. Right, let's try a bit of tube around this, uh, around this water. Door, guilty. One second. So just uh, capturing a bit more of that water and it said roof and it said guilty or whatever but I can't really make much sense of that but this is what you want to be worried about now all the water oh. pushing some of the bricks out false you're not making much sense to be honest church church no it's weird it said that because it's called new church twin tunnel shine thing. shine I bet Judith Judith. Judith, I need you to come in front of the camera, yeah? Please, for me. Right, let's try again. See if, we get, see if we get some more audio this time. I'm 
when you come to this light see that's what the light has five six vms maybe at tops there's no milligauss coming off low lightage i'll just turn the camera off so you can see actually i'll just turn it look 11 milligauss uh, 11 vm sorry there's no milligauss can you come and leave your voice please that's what i'm after any train sounds train brakes anything like that I had to think, think that this time I actually thought there was a train coming then funny enough but it's obviously just the traffic but that's mad isn't it, I thought there was a train coming Right, see what captures we get. What you're about to see is some kind of intelligence um, in front of the camera. So this is the end of the one tunnel. There's another tunnel. Shit, that's gone off. Can you make this device go up, please? One second. Can you make it go up? I just seen you on the camera. Always when I'm not ready. is just blasting away and this this is what I mean when it rains it's hard to get stuff so we'll go back down there see what we get is that, is that you in front of the camera you can tell me your name although you have done already not going to get too caught up in that Go away. Yeah, I'm doing now. Well, obviously, you can't get caught up in stuff like that. Just something that you just don't accept it and move on. Disrespectful. Who is she? Teresa. My guardian angel. Twenty. Twenty what? I mean, century. Jason, I said no. So that's Teresa telling you no. They're obviously talking amongst themselves, so what I'm going to do now, I'm trying to hit the box. Whilst I come back down here where they ask for the book, because I need to listen to them. So we're after some more audio, really. Right, so this is obviously New Church Tunnel. Um, at night, I'm gonna get some pictures now anyway, and um, try somewhere else. See what other stuff we can get. So these are just some pictures uh, that I took. Uh, the first one is obviously I think it's just my breath. Uh, this is obviously the entrance, if you like. The other one, it's obviously cemented up. Uh, but yeah, these are like I said, just some pictures on the full moon. So let's get back uh, to the video.
thousand feet. <coughs> got the airstrip on. The other one's a bit more bendy. Um, but I don't need to go down there because I've already covered it. It was more or less this one. And what, what's interesting about this tunnel, there's nowhere to go to hide. Like in the one in Oldham, you've got like little little stand spots so you can st you know, stand in if there were a train coming, if you were doing work or whatever. Well, this one doesn't have any. That's one out of power now. Give me a sign that that, that that was you. On the audio, please. I didn't really get a sign, but um, obviously you can see the Vox, how much disturbance is being caused in the Vox, and that's obviously due to the uh, residual energy and obviously high spirits. Maybe not. It's like this, li literally this is like the dark part of Bear Cup. Well, not many people come, especially at night. Now this would be ideal with my green pen, but we end up in the washing machine, so I ain't got it. Check your pants before you put stuff in the washing machine. So my green pen of well or a new one. This is why you need a green pen in here. Is to help with manifestations. This is probably the most spookiest spot there is in this uh, tunnel. No. The light's not working either, which makes it even more spookier. <laughs> wow. Well, I'll show my torch so it goes away. It must be scared of light or whatever. See what I mean? I just heard some kind of cough in there. Come down there. the wide the book. I can see why. Right, I have to go now. Closed. Closed. Right, I'm going now. I'll see you later, yeah? Nice talking to you. Spell. Spell. What do you spell? Drink. Is that you doing that to a torch? Right, that one's for me, so I'm going to click it back on. So, it's right. so anyway, it's time to go on now. It's time to go, so I'm going to... Cable. Cable. Thread. That's what, they, um, that's what they usually call the lights. Right, I'm going. Time for me to go in the video. and. Um, I'll have a speaker one. Obviously not the best because it was raining, but I'll speak to you soon, yeah? Peace for now and um, see you soon. So what I learned from this visit is obviously the, all the activities by the number 8. Uh, for some reason, I don't know why. Uh, we'll have to look into it a bit more. But it was a spooky visit, this one. I uh, really enjoyed it. Anyway, hopefully you did. Speak to you soon.